Captain, once again, your leadership has set a fine example to the rest of my officers. Vice Admiral Stukov has informed me that the Siege Disruptor has been accounted for, so we can now proceed with the next phase of our operation. The time has come to begin our primary invasion of the Dominion Throne world of Koro. Alexei, fill the Captain in on the current situation. As you may know from your research, Captain, Coral was a hotbed of anti-Confederate sentiment for years. The Confederacy hoped to contain Coral's civil unrest by decimating it and its population with a massive nuclear barrage. Though the radiation levels on the planet are at an all-time low, its surface is now nothing more than a smoldering desert. The catch, Admiral is that because this world has already been devastated by nuclear fire, Minsk has no compunction against using nukes on us. We have detected a large cluster of missile silos on the outskirts of Augustgrad. If those silos were destroyed, we believe that Minsk would lose its core nuclear capabilities. We also face a different obstacle, Captain. Intelligence has informed us that Minsk employs multiple battle cruisers for his planetary defense. It is possible to nullify these battle cruisers by taking out strategic physics labs. Without these labs, Manx will be unable to power up his ship's weapon systems. Though we know how to compensate for Manx's defenses, we don't have enough time to follow through on them both. Therefore, Captain. You must choose to either counter his nuclear capabilities or his battle cruisers. Once you've taken care of this operation, we can begin to plan our final assault against Augustgrad. Base is under attack. 